Alex, are you seeing what I'm seeing? I think so. Isn't that the girl who's been bothering you? Zack, what are you doing? Uh, what is he doing here? Come on, Alex, let's go. What is going on here? Stay close to me, Alex. Well, hello. Zack, who was that girl you were just talking to? You guys looked pretty suspicious. What's going on here? Uh, turn off that light. It's really annoying. Isn't that the girl who's been stalking Alex and her friends? Why were you talking to her? She was really close to you, Zack. Look, this girl has been bothering me too. And I was just talking to her. Oh yeah? About what? Heh, <laughs> wouldn't you like to know? I'm so confused. I don't think we should trust this guy, Alex. Ugh, you're the one to talk. I got my own suspicions about you, too. See, Alex, I told you this guy is good for nothing. Excuse me? The only bad guy here is you. Guys, there's no need to argue right now. Stay away from Alex. <laughs> what are you, her dad? What? No, I just love her, and I don't want her around you. If you really loved her, you'd let her choose who she wants to be with. Oh yeah? Well, I'm really confident she's gonna choose to be with me. Huh. If you're so confident about that, why are you so worried about me being around her? Well, I... it's just... <laughs> I really doubt Alex could love a psychopath like you. Oh yeah? Watch me. I'm gonna win her love unlike you. She's not just a trophy you can win, you know. Well, I uh... Guys, stop! If all you're gonna do is just argue, I'm gonna get out of here. Alex, come back. No! Oh, great. Now my little pumpkin's upset now. What? That's cringe, don't say that. You're a fool if you think I have a chance with her. Uh, with what you just said, I'm pretty sure I have twice the amount of chances now. Hey, you watch that mouth. You're boring. What? I'm not done with you, coward. Come back. What? He's calling me? No. Don't want to talk to anyone right now. Ugh. He's calling me again? I don't want to talk. Are you kidding me? I do not want to answer your phone calls right now. You jerk. Huh? Hello? Who is it? It's me, Zack. Can you let me in? Zack! What are you doing here? Why do you keep rejecting my calls? Well, because I obviously don't want to talk to anyone right now. Are you upset because you saw me talking to that girl? You know, the one who's been bothering us all. Oh, yeah. Why were you talking to her anyway? It's a really long story. It looked like you guys were really close. You don't think I'm interested in her, do you? No. I've already gotten used to so many girls chasing after you. I guess that weirdo stalker girl likes you too, huh? Yeah, I'm surprised about it too. I really don't want you to be upset at me. Can you let me in? Hmm... <laughs> wow, there's so many cute girls that want to talk to me. Whoa, this one is so cute. Oh, I guess Zack's back. About time. Wait, what? What's this? Dear Zack, I'm going to warn you right now. Your biggest secret will be revealed on Valentine's Day? What? Until then, you have a chance to make a deal with me. Contact Shadow Girl for more information. I'm expecting to hear from you soon. Do not disappoint. You don't want to mess with me. Signed F. Huh. Looks like the threats with F aren't stopping. Uh, but where's Zack? He should have been back by now. Uh, let me call that knucklehead and tell him about this. Come on. Why are you making me wait out here so long? Because I haven't decided whether I want to let you in or not. Ugh, who's calling me? Light? Eh, whatever. If your friend was calling you, he's 
probably worried about you. You should get back to your apartment. Nothing he says is going to be important. Let me in. I'm going to be waiting here all night. Fine. I'll let you in. Come on in. Finally. Just come in. Ah, uh, Zack, you idiot. Pick up. Uh, why aren't you answering me? Uh, I can't waste any more time. I need to go find him and warn him. But first, I gotta go respond back to that cute girl. I'm not gonna miss my chance. So, why do you and my ex-boyfriend have to fight all the time? <laughs> Cause that idiot thinks he's gonna be your boyfriend. He doesn't like that we hang out all the time. Yeah, but you guys don't have to keep fighting over me like I'm some kind of trophy. Yeah, you're right. He only wants to get back together with you to make up for that one time he cheated. Haven't you heard the phrase, once a cheater, always a cheater? Yeah, I've heard that phrase before, but that doesn't mean anything. Jack's changed. The only thing that's changed is his hair. You deserve to be treated better. <laughs> you need a prince in your life, not some rat. You're, you're calling my ex-boyfriend a rat? Don't get mad, I'm just stating facts. Why were you alone with him anyways? Did you guys go on a date or something? I guess something like that. We kind of talked and sat by a lake and walked through the woods. I guess that's kind of a date. A <laughs> walk to the woods? That's the cheapest idea of a date. Man, that guy really puts no effort. Uh, excuse me? Let me take you out. I'll show you what a real date's supposed to be like. Did you just... Did you just ask me out on a date? <laughs> well, do you want to or not? Really? But isn't it so soon already? You're just a few days ago you confessed your feelings to me, but I feel like it now is going by too fast. Fine, no date then. But have you eaten any dinner yet? Well, not yet. I am kind of hungry. Then, let's go out to eat somewhere. Oh, uh, okay. But it's not a date, okay? Right. It's not a date. We're just going out to eat. Just the two of us. But not a date. Fine. Um, let's go eat then. And don't look at me like that anymore. Alright, well, let's get on our way to our non-date. Just dinner. Right. Not a date. <laughs> hmm. So, here we are. Um, excuse me, what kind of fancy place is this? We're having dinner here, and that's final. You said this wasn't a date! It's not a date. What makes you think it is? Um, because this place looks extremely fancy. So? It doesn't mean anything. I just like eating here. Oh, Zack. Glad to have you back, sir. Heh. <laughs> See, princess? Told you I'd come here often. Uh, what? We're having dinner for two. Right this way, sir. Alright, let's go. Expensive restaurants in town? What are we doing here? Since you're one of our most valuable guests, I'll take you to the best table. Come on, let's go. What is this? Huh? Please, take a seat. <laughs> Ladies first. Um, Zach, are you sure you want to eat here? If you're worried about the price, don't worry, it's my treat. Would you like to order the usual, sir? Hey, are you okay with curry with rice? Uh, yeah, sure. I'll be right on it, sir. Zach, I'm so confused. Why is that guy treating you like you're some type of royalty or something? <laughs> Seems you don't know a lot about me. Do you? Well, I guess I don't, do I? You, you just seem like a normal high school student to me. <laughs> Interesting. Here's your dinner, sir. Please enjoy. Thank you. We'll let you know if we need anything else. Hmm, this looks really good. It looks really fancy, too. Try it out. It's my favorite. Hmm, wow, that's really good. Uh, but hey, uh, 
when you asked me to come have dinner with you, I kind of imagined us just going out and getting burgers or something, not come here to such an elegant restaurant. If you like the place so much, you should come with me. I eat here all the time. No, this place is pretty pricey. I wouldn't want you to spend so much money on me all the time. I really don't mind. Would you like me to play some romantic music for you both? Heh, <laughs> do you want that, princess? What? But we're not out here on a date. <laughs> it's not a date. I'd be fine with some romantic music. Romantic music coming right up, sir. Zack, what are you doing? This isn't a date. I thought we agreed. Oh, but listen, isn't the music lovely? <laughs> You're blushing. Hey, stop looking at me. Seriously, we should have just gone out to eat burgers. Uh, burgers? You really think I'm gonna take a girl like you to a cheap place like that? I would have been fine with it. I can never forgive myself if I took you on such a cheap date. This isn't a date! Are you sure about that? We both agreed that it wasn't gonna be a date and now you're trying to make it into a date? <laughs> I mean, you like me and I like you. What's wrong with calling it a date? <laughs> Who said? Who said I liked you? You know, it's pretty obvious already. So, when are you gonna confess your feelings to me? 